How many of you like to use straws? How many of you take plastic grocery bags from the grocery stores? And how many do you think you use each time that you make a trip to the grocery store? Think about how many of these items you are constantly using and therefore consecutively throwing in the trash. Plastic grocery bags, straws, and plastic cups to go containers, there are too many to name. What would happen if each one of us cut using one group of these single use plastic straws? I am an advocate for reducing the use of plastic and recycling. I try my best to keep oceans in mind and have witnessed firsthand how bad plastic can affect them. I have decreased my use of straws and try to be constantly aware of the single use plastic I am using. Plastic waste and pollution is one of the biggest issues regarding our oceans. First, let's look at plastic pollution. Pollution is filling our oceans and landfills. According to Ocean Crusaders, it is now believed that there are 5.25 trillion pieces of plastic in the ocean. There is litter and waste constantly entering the ocean. We think we see a lot of it on the beach, but we don't. According to World Ocean Network, around 15% of litter lands on the beach, 15% floats, and around 70% goes down to the ocean floor. Pollution affects humans, not just animals. According to World Ocean Network, one in 20 adults after swimming in a body of water deemed acceptable become ill after exposure. Plastic is one of the biggest polluters. According to Milo Press, Americans use 500 million different types of straws every day. According to OceanCrusaders.com, over 100,000 marine creatures a year die from plastic entanglement, and these are only the ones that are found. Laura Parker from National Geographic states that every year, about 8 million tons of plastic waste escapes into the oceans from coastal nations. That is the equivalent of setting five garbage bags full of trash on every foot of coastline around the world. Plastic waste also has additives, which extends the life of plastic litter estimating that some of it takes at least 400 years to break down, as said by National Geographic. How can we make a change? If we exchanged using plastic straws, we could reduce the amount of plastic in our oceans drastically. Making small, simple changes can start a movement of change. Although straws aren't the only problem, Making the effort to stop using single-use plastics is a place to start. If each person changed the way they use plastics, the whole world could change. According to another article from National Geographic, 8 million tons of plastic float into the ocean every year. Straws make up 0.025% of that. I know what you are thinking, and you are right. Straws themselves do not make a huge mark on the percentage, but it draws attention to the problem we are facing and is a starting point. Reducing straws could lead to reusable grocery bags, refillable water bottles, and even reusable coffee cups. Many brands are taking a stand toward eliminating single-use plastic, such as Starbucks with its drinking lids, plastic, and water washer-safe cups for hot and cold drinks. According to Starbucks, their goal is to double the recycled content recyclability, compostability, and reusability of their cups and packaging by 2022. According to Washington Post, a lot of smaller sized plastics such as straws fall through the recycling system, adding to the issue of microplastics, which the marine animals end up consuming and therefore you end up consuming if you eat seafood. Today, I've demonstrated the beginning of reducing use of single plastics starting with straws. Pollution fills our oceans and planet. Starting by using reduce, reducing the use of straws, we can slowly change the problem at hand. Plastic was invented to make life easier, but has instead started to destroy our planet. Plastic fills our oceans and landfills. Eight million tons or more of plastic are in the ocean, and a small percentage of this is straws. It is dangerous for marine life and for our health. 
By making small changes in our lives, we can make a change in our environment. Will you help the planet by making a change?